Oh, hello my friends. Sorry, cleaning again. Uh, today I'm uh, showing you how to clean and to replace the air filters and add one additional air filter which is not in the scrapbook for uh, this air conditioner just to make it uh, run much smoother. So again, replacement of filters, washing of filters. This here is the carbon filter which comes with the machine. Uh, it costs when I replace it a new one around 20 bucks. $20 for that here? Oh my god. No, 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 no. Yeah, but I have also a 3M filter. I bought a 3M filter for this machine. Also doesn't come standard with the 3M filter. The 3M filter was $41. Can you believe it? Just for the small air conditioner here. All right. Well, I was talking already too much. Yeah, today is April the 29th, 2018. And today is Sunday. This is my day where I make whoop. I mean Wupnik movies. So before we start the filter business, I want to show you guys how to detach these uh, hoses from the air conditioner unit. One of my uh, viewers and hopefully subscribers, so one of my viewers slash subscribers has asked me to show him how to remove these hoses. They are kind of stuck and that's good. So you have to use a couple, a little bit of uh, brute force to, uh, to get them off. So what you do is basically you take this one here and you turn it uh, clockwise and you turn it clockwise very heavily ah, see up you just lift it up clockwise and you lift it up and again with this one you see it is all in you cannot get it out you turn it heavy very forceful clockwise and lift it up ah, there it is you see, it's that easy. Of course, putting them back together. Again, here are two uh, plastic prongs. Yeah, you have to line up those holes with these plastic prongs here in order to make it click in. Yeah, so now we are lining it up. Lining, lining, and down. Have you heard the double click? That's it, it must double click, then it is all stable inside, will not move. Let's do the other one. Again, here, line it up with these notches, they move in inward a little bit. Yep, here's a hole, line it up, be as straightforward as possible, and, yeah. See, that's it. Yep, this is all what you need in order to uh, get rid of the hoses. Just use lots of force, okay? So this here is my Winter ARC-14SH from the back. And here you see how dirty the filter for my air conditioner unit is. So you really have to clean it or else you can damage your air conditioner. So you see here is a place where the filter should be totally dirty. So and now I'm taking here the uh, a cleaning wand of my Dyson DC65 and clean up everything what's left there. Careful noise. So you see everything is clean here now and so and now let's see how it looks inside the other hose output. Yeah there is a fan down there. It looks like a hamster wheel. Yep. This is how it looks from this side inside my air conditioner. As you can see, after four years, still everything is working just fine. Ooh. So, and this here now is the output, the cold air output. Let's see what's going on in here. Yep. Well, as you can see, another hamster wheel shaped fan. So you have to remove this contraption here and you do it like that. 
Ah, here it goes. <laughs> so you do it like, like that. Here is the actual cooler. Yeah, again, a little bit dust in it. Here is the uh, carbon filter which came with the machine. Now after so many washes it is just ruined. We have to put another one in. The original Dyson one costs over $20. So I have found something equally good and much less expensive, much less. So and now I'm taking here the uh, a cleaning wand of my Dyson DC65 and clean up everything what's left there. Careful, noise. <laughs> So now let's go on. These are all the filters which I bought. Here is the 3M filter. It's an antimicrobial filter for portable air conditioners, especially winter. You see this one here, $41. This is just one piece, $41. But it's supposed to be superb. It works great. Uh, well, I spent the $41. Yeah, let's uh, indulge a little bit, okay? So this is this one, it belongs here, fits perfectly. And then as a replacement for the uh, carbon filter, got this here right now from uh, Amazon. Here, no name carbon filter. Yeah, it's not the winter stuff, but should work equally good and I paid for it. This is for six, five or six filters. You have to cut it down to the size you need it. And so it is unbeatable cheap uh, for, uh, for this winter here. All six, all five or six costs uh, as, as much as un one filter from winter. You see, it's, it's a big blanket. You have to cut it a little bit. Yeah, let's cut it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, let's use this one here as a template for the carbon filter. Okay. A little bit tough to cut, but you can do it. It's doable. It's just a filter. I mean, filters are important, but yeah, I spent already on, on this one $41. No good. $41. And now here up. Okay. Mm, see? Now it's ready for another year and I don't have to wash these things. Uh, it's a little bit crooked. I mean here, it's a little bit crooked. Who cares? So, all right. And then here another filter, which was never here with, uh, with this air conditioner. This is an air filter for the intake hose. See here, there's another filter in here for the intake hose. And this here is the uh, intake hose, the left one. Yeah, and uh, I assume now you just put it in here and then on top of it, uh, the hose again. And uh, this little toy has cost me $33. $33 for this piece of plastic. Damn it, when it comes to air conditioners, they really rob you blind. Yeah, let's put it in here. Let's do it like that. And click, click. All right, we have a click, click. And now we have, as you can see, yeah, we have an air filter over the intake one. Very nice. So what else? Yeah. You see this here is a complete cassette. Yeah, you take this one out 
and now you are down to the bare bones in order to get to the air filter here, to the carbon filter, you have to take this out, then you take that out, this is lots of stuff to take out, and then you put this one in here. A little bit small, I should have cut it bigger. Where is it? Where is ah. Ah, yeah. yeah, I'm not the best when it comes down to cutting a straight. I usually cut in curves. Okay. All right, now it fits kind of, yeah, kind of fitting. Okay. So you put this one back in here. There are two notches which, which have to line up. All right, look at that. Ha! Ah. See? So let's see where we should place a 3M filter. Of course you have to take it out of the box first. Yep. I will let you know of course how the 3M filter is uh, doing, if it's worth it to get this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it fits here. Um, yep, and of course here is all ooey gooey. So I got a dust brush to make it a little bit look nicer. Yeah, it's not so important that everything is absolute dust and lint free here. There's always dust somewhere. Yeah, but just for visual appearances, make it look nice. All right, and that's it. All right. Let's see if it works. Okay. This was the filter replacement for a Winter ARC-14SH. The S version is exactly the same. Yeah, you see, not a big deal, but you need a filter. When you don't have a filter here, you can damage the whole cooling system. You can damage uh, the, the uh, con condensation drip out thing. Yeah, you can clog that up and then just the water is uh, uh, stopping and cannot get out, the whole machine is stopping. So, yeah. As I said, on the incoming filter, put here uh, this uh, little filter on top of it, $33. Well, mm. okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed my little uh, air conditioner filter replacement video. Uh, if you want to see more about my air conditioner and of course my Dyson DC65 and and and, please come on back very soon. Most likely I will publish another video in about one week. Alright, well have a great Sunday afternoon. I wish you the best and please like this video and subscribe. I need your subscriptions, okay? I need more subscriptions. Support my channel, all right? Okay, that's it. Well, have a great and wonderful uh, Sunday afternoon.